Hello? Okay. So I would like to talk to you about the Triton success stories. Um, I talk here with my hat of uh, Triton Foundation board member, not part of B2CK and not part of the board member. In fact, it's only my opinion. Uh, so in May, we have decided to tackle the issue of the uh, success stories that are missing on the website. And we have decided to change the rule for the companies. Uh, the new rule is that the foundation now requires companies on the service page to provide at least a business case within the six months. So it was in May. So the six months deadline is in November. <laughs> the first week of November. And so here are the results of the uh, success stories in order received. So the first uh, success story we received is the one made by John there about the law firm. Thank you, John. Yes, then there was the success story made by Christopher from Addictions. Where is he? He's not there, but uh, it was about a wine importer. So thank you. Then uh, the, the next one was B2CK success story. Uh, we, we collaborated with Cisalp uh, on a company migrating from Odoo to, uh, to Triton. And uh, they make uh, vision-based systems. Now, <laughs> thank you. A fun fact about Tree is that it's the first op prime. Yeah. It's strange. Yeah. <laughs> the sad fact about Tree is that it's the number of success stories we have received. So uh, I don't know about you, but I find that this is very sad that only 17% of the companies on the service page have submitted success stories. Yeah. <laughs> so that was Triton before. You know, we were almost everywhere, uh, even in the United States. And this is now. Yeah. OK. I don't know you about you, but I find that this is a shame. Yeah. Alors, uh, so I have some hypothesis about this. So maybe the service page is useless, and we don't care about it. Maybe the company are using Triton, but they don't want to be associated with Triton anymore. Maybe they do not plan to sell Triton anymore, so they don't want to advertise it. Maybe some companies have gone bankrupt. And in fact, we know that some companies have gone bankrupt. So it will allow us to clean the company. Maybe the company has never done any implementation. So it's nice to remove them, because in the end, they don't provide service about Triton. Or maybe they care about their customers' privacy. In fact, I received one answer from one company saying, no, I will not contribute because I care about my customer privacy and I don't want to provide uh, success stories, which is something I can perfectly understood. In fact, I can understand all the, the reason. The fact is that I received only one negative answer. And finally, since there is still two weeks, we can hope that, in fact, the companies are working just in time for this problem, and that in the next two weeks, I will receive, I don't know, six, seven, ten success stories. It's up to you, in fact. <laughs> Questions? <laughs> Remarks? Pledge to submit the success stories? 
at least one. Okay. Thank you, Nicolas, for the reminder. <laughs> and uh, now Cedric uh, presents uh, some numbers of the Triton Foundation. And uh, you will see um, how much we, uh, we can do uh, with uh, less efforts. Microphone. So this is the balance sheet of the foundation. Uh, they have uh, all the moves for uh, until the end of September. So that's all I've included until now. And uh, is it in French? Because it's the, a French foundation, a Belgium foundation. So the chart of account is the Belgium chart of account. So it's in French. So sorry for that. <laughs> Uh, I will try to translate. Here you have uh, the, uh, the assets of uh, the foundation. Uh, the, uh, it's clear? Yeah, okay. Uh, <laughs> and here you get all the benefits since uh, the beginning of the foundation, and by benefits, I mean foundation. Uh, and we have here some, uh, I guess there is still an invoice to pay because it's, it's a debt, uh, uh, it's, a, it's a debit. Uh, I guess I didn't make yet the payment for the hosting or something like that. Uh, and here you have the incomes for uh, until now, uh, for this year. This is for this year. Uh, so we receive this amount in uh, donation. And by donation, we have some people who make recurring donation. That's very good because it's something we can expect. Uh, we get this year a big donation. Uh, and uh, also, all the small donation that we get with the conference. Uh, about the donation, if you want to see, you can find our best donator on the foundation website, uh, at the, on the donation page. You will see here below, and it's loaded, uh, the best donators. Let's applause them, maybe. Yeah. <laughs> so, thank you. Uh, yeah. And so, yeah, this is what uh, we can plan. Uh, so we have already spent half of we, what we receive this year, and so yeah, it's going a little better each year. For now, it's mainly on support the hardware we rent. We have uh, one machine to host the website, the bug packer, and the tools, and so on. We have one machine that runs the test uh, for each commit, and uh, another one, the, uh, a Mac, uh, a mini Mac to build the Mac client. So, and I think yeah, we have just enough funding to maintain that and to sh secure the resources. So, voila. <laughs> <laughs> so no. <laughs> there is any questions about the numbers? Yeah. So you spend uh, around uh, 900 euros. Uh, it's the, from the uh, beginning of the year to till this day, or is this uh, from for this, uh, whole year? Uh, uh, what? 
Uh, it's for this fiscal year. Okay. Yeah. That's, uh, it's for this fiscal Do you have any projection for the money you need for a whole year? The, uh, with this, indeed, uh, the renewal of the hosting fees it, uh, is in August, so I uh, already pay until the next year, end of July. It's every year we pay yeah, the... Basically, if you have, what, uh, 1,000 euro a year, you're happy? Is this what you were saying? Or? Uh, I, or do you have plans for the future? We, uh, you want we say it's enough to run what we have now. Okay. But you don't want more. You don't it's need more. You don't. It depends uh, of the uh, goals of the foundation. What we want to do. I, I if we want to uh, make bigger event or uh, so something that I think it could be useful for the foundation. For the foundation is to support or uh, organize uh, a caton. I don't know if you are familiar with this kind of stuff. It's a way re to invite some core developers, people that are, uh, we know we produce something for one week, we put everybody to together in one place, and we lock the doors, and we wait at the end of the weekend, and we get a lot of stuff done. <laughs> so, and I think if we want to do something like that, we need to have uh, some, uh, money to pay the, the flight for each developer and uh, pay maybe the, the step to, to get them there and, uh, because it's, it's not uh, always easy to ask that for the company so if we can do that this way. But we want to invite. But we want to invite Sergi, for example, or Xavier, which is a new core committer. Hey, hello. <laughs> but they need to come from Spain, and uh, as you know, the plane is not free. Uh, living in Liège is not free. Staying in Liège neither. So we need money. But so far now, we have enough money to sustain the servers sustain the service that we use. But if we want to uh, make some stuff and organize coding sprints and stuff like that, of course there is uh, each year the conference where we do that, but it would maybe be better, but it's not mandatory to maybe once a year do that in uh, not maybe, maybe not in Liège, maybe in some nicer place. <laughs> I don't know, uh, Miami or... Should not be or too nice, otherwise <laughs> nothing will be done. And, and so you can see that we can do that in Liège, it will not it will be really cheap, but we can do that in Miami or in Hawaii, and so it will be more costly, obviously. <laughs> but it make, will, me, will make us more happier and probably better coders. And there is other stuff that the foundation could also organize. Uh, more events or send people to specific event to promote Triton or <laughs> stuff like that. Because for now, we never send an, anyone to a, a big, big event, ERP event or whatever to promote Triton, say, hey, we are there, we can do something for you. So I think, yeah, it's part of the, of the mission of the foundation, which is to promote Triton. So for now, I think we do just the minimal. Any more questions? Hello, any questions? Remarks, thoughts, also, complaints? Uh, when we are on the foundation, uh, I should remember just, uh, uh, I'm wondering why we still uh, continue paying for services like uh, hosting uh, test server, hosting code, uh, code hosting uh, issues, when we have uh, free services for that, gratis, uh, <laughs> from uh, GitHub or uh, other uh, providers. Yeah, uh, 
we got disturbed two years ago. And the issue with those gratis services is that, uh, as Ruiz reminded, uh, uh, most of the time you, you are not really free with it. Uh, we tried in the past, for example, for testing, we get uh, a deal with a company providing uh, continuous integration. And uh, the issue was that Triton has too much test, and so it took too long to run every test, and uh, the machine where they run the test, were, we, are, we were exhausting the memory because they didn't clean correctly stuff. And at the end, we never get any succeed build because it was time out and killed. Uh, and the issue is that as we don't have access to that, we cannot fix and we are just need to expect or ask gently to the guys, could you fix your server to make us happy? <laughs> and so for that, doesn't help. But uh, for the machine to, that run the test, it's just a machine, a plain bare metal machine that we buy once. And for now, they, they have, this machine doesn't have recurring fees for, for the foundation. And we can expect to get it for five years. So I'm, not, I'm, I'm just not, not saying that uh, it costs too much. The, uh, for me, the issue is that uh, these platforms are, uh, could uh, make Triton more visible. But we are. We have a mirror on GitHub. We have a mirror on yeah. Bucket. If it's about having the network effect, it's there. It should be there. But personally, since two years, I didn't really see it happening. But that's always people say, well, you should be on GitHub because of the network effect. But we are on GitHub. And so we have. I don't think it's made something more or less. So I don't think it's really important. More questions? Uh, I wanted to show, to remember, that you can be a supporter of the foundation. This is the current supporter. And being supporter is just a way for, for you to say, uh, we, uh, we want to be part of the foundation, and we want to be involved, and we support the foundation. Uh, for that, it's pretty easy. You just have to ask to the foundation or to one of the board member yes. to be a supporter, and we will accept you or not. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, and uh, and the supporter is one uh, goals in the foundation is in some way they, they are there to uh, to verify the work of the board. So if the supporter thinks that the board is not doing well the, the work, they can uh, ask to change the board. If with a majority and so on, so it's explained in the status. But so if you want to have a little bit power in the foundation, this is the first step. <laughs> to go. So. Yeah. Uh, regarding no. the numbers. But we, we change it this, this summer. We change it, the machine. And it's normally it's uh, four times. Uh, we, we got just one core, not we have four core. Uh, more, uh, four giga of, mem of memory. I didn't test lately, but it was something that was pretty slow for the demo server. And uh, personally, I, I think now it's pretty fast. But I don't know if someone have been working in the source code repository and the book tracker, and it's faster, plenty faster. Yeah, uh, uh, two years ago, we make also, we uh, time it cloning Triton from <coughs> our server and cloning Triton from Bitbucket or GitHub, and from our server was faster, from two or five times faster. Uh, 
Any other questions? Complaints? Ah, one complaint. <laughs> Ah, Who is in the board? Uh, maybe you Here? stand up. Yeah. Does he know? <laughs> so, <laughs> everybody on the board, <laughs> please stand up. <laughs> and Sharon. And there is Sharon, which is Mia, <laughs> missing in action. <laughs> so, yeah. Sharon is missing since two years now. One? So, yeah. Normally we are seven. But. Yeah. Good. It seems there are no more questions. No? Thank you, uh, Cedric and Niklas. We must uh, finish now the Triton Arn conference. And uh, I thank you for to be a patient the and great audience. The first day. There is another day. Uh, yeah, we finished, of course, the first day. but. Uh, Tomorrow is the next day, and we will start at 9.30. Um, I guess it will take a quarter to 10 uh, when we really start, but uh, then I would say uh, we should start. Tomorrow is uh, the more technical track. That means uh, everyone is invited, but uh, expect it will be more boring than uh, the usual business-related stuff we have heard today. But uh, we are all uh, now that it's boring. Yeah, also, uh, about the dinner tonight, uh, ah, cool. everyone that uh, has registered, or you, even if you haven't, uh, the restaurant is open to everyone. <laughs> it's uh, just at the opposite corner. OK, there's a restaurant there. It's named El Salado. And also, you have in your email the, the address and the link to the Google map. I think uh, we have a little bit of time uh, to, um, to spend uh, in, in the room uh, beside uh, that we can uh, have a drink and, uh, um, and say goodbye or continue talks uh, as you want, but you're free. Thank you. Thank you.